Greetings fellow Decepticons, Sandblast1987 here and welcome to part 2 of the Spino Thunder review and part 3 of the Dime Volcano and Kashiri Neptune reviews. This combination is going to be called Gigant Kishiryu O or the Primal Fusion Ultrazord from Power Rangers Dino Fury. This combines the gold, red and blazing zords together into one. So, first of all, I've got Tiramigo in his set, warrior mode, for red reuse all his out for the time being. So, in order to prepare for this combination, what needs to be done is taking off the guns, the drills, the T-Rex head, and the T-Rex tail. Well, the T-Rex tail can stay where it is, actually, but... Then, in order to properly prepare for the combination, attach both of the drills and one of the turrets to Tiramigo's head, like so. Then attach that onto this arm, like so. The other turret will be used in a moment. So, First, what you want to do is take off all of the pieces of Spino Thunder, like so. Because this combination primarily uses the T-Rex and Mosa heads as the yeah, hand weapons, this combination in the show is not officially supposed to have a handheld weapon. However, there are enough parts left over that I've managed to invent my own, which I'll show off in a moment. So, what you want to do next is split the Mosa legs all together, like your immortal combat fatality. Split in half, like so. Fold this clip away. Then these will become the new feet, so what you want to do is have them facing gold part forward, like so. These silver pegs here go into the holes on the bottom of Tiramigo's robot mode feet, like so. Then swing the rear fins backwards, the like foot clamp supports, like the Time Shadow, Shadow Force, Megazord combinations from Power Rangers Time Force. I haven't reviewed that set yet, but I will get it eventually for a review, so forgive me. Whoops. So, once that's been added, then you want to attach most of Rex's head, so the ports are facing this way, and the head is pointing the other, like so. Then remove the Mera Merisol and replace it with the Gold Reasol. Like so. Connect onto the post like so. Then seal it in place by connecting these pegs here with the turret like so. You'll have to bear with me for this one. I'm doing everything from arms length from behind the toys, so. It's a little bit awkward at times, so bear with me. Then, DMA Volcano legs become shoulder cannons, like with the blazing T-Rex Warrior 4, that I've already shown off previously. Like so. Now, you're supposed to use the Red Reusol as the head for this one, but since I can't find mine at the moment, I'll be using the Mera Merisol this time around. Then, what you want to do is split Dime Volcano's tail so it becomes a new chest plate, like so. Peg that on. Then peg this piece on, like so. And this flips up to become the new head armor, like so, to complete the helmet. Now, for the remaining parts, what I like to do is...
combine the remaining parts together into a combined so fair, not as any staff weapon as such, but and before I forget, the most of things become the kneecaps for this uh, combination. With the Spinosaurus arms facing outwards for obvious, you know, parts clearance reasons, like so. And here we have Gigan Kishirio O with the custom weapon that I've designed. He uses up every single part of this parts forming combination. It's a bit finagling to get into the hand with a T Rex head in the way without smashing everything, but it can be done. And here we have Gigan Kishirio O. For size comparison, here we have most of the Samurai Gigazord from Power Rangers Super Samurai. This is my standard go-to for large comparisons in my reviews, so some of the parts have fallen off over the past few weeks. As you can see, this is one of the largest combinations I've had for quite some time for a Super Sentai combiner on my channel, but there are larger combinations I can make with some of my future purchase plans, so stay tuned throughout the year for even bigger combinations. Having said that, that completes my Ring Soldier reviews for the time being. I'll get more toys from this line eventually for future reviews, so stay tuned for more. I have been Sandblaster1987. Join me next time when I will be reviewing part one of a six part group of reviews for a Chinese undersized knockoff of the Mini Force X Penta Xtron combiner, starting with Leo the tank. Till then, till all are one, and may the power protect you. Always.